Hey everyone, Chris here, back in Junkyard Truck. And first things first, I kind of decided to paint the truck green. I don't know, just kind of felt a little bit better, maybe more off-roady. But I really want to check out why we didn't have power on those hills. I don't know if maybe it's the transmission thing or something with those like drive gears. So let me pull the truck in and we'll get under it to check it out. Alright, let's see how these look. Honestly, that looks pretty good. It doesn't look like rusted or anything. Let me check the front one. Yeah, this one looks fine too. It's like not rust or anything that looks broken, at least as far as from what I can tell. So let's put these back on and then I guess we'll check the transmission. Because what I'm thinking is that maybe we just burned out the clutch. Because I did click shift a couple times and I think the game does say like, like it might give you a boost of power it also might wear out the clutch, so let's see how that looks. It looks just like the brand new one, so not sure. Let's put that back on. And then I guess we'll just have to check something else. I don't know. Yeah, because everything else seems okay. There's nothing that's like popping out as like broken, at least from what I can tell. Yeah, everything looks pretty good. Let's check under the cover. I mean, those rockers are looking a little bit rusted. And I feel like they shouldn't because they're pretty new, you know? I don't know. Maybe that's just like the game showing a little bit of oil or something on it. Okay, well, let's look through the manual and see if we can find out what's wrong. Because there is a troubleshooting like page over here. So maybe it'll tell us like, oh, loss of power, check this. Okay, so it does talk about larger gears. That if we get larger ones, they'll have more power but use more gas. So that might be a good thing to do. And this is just, I guess, troubleshooting if one of the lights come on, which I don't think we've actually had a problem with, so should be good. Head gasket, valve train, piston. Hmm. Oh, okay. So I have been hearing, I don't know if it's a whirring noise or a metallic grinding noise. Yeah, because it does make that I guess that's more of a whirring sound, right? And what did it say? That was a fan clutch? Yeah, fan clutch. Okay. Pretty sure we changed that out. Okay, so that might be something to look into. I've also seen online that there's like either moonshining or like tobacco growing or something. Not sure how though. No, we have this bucket. So, I don't know. We'll, we'll kind of explore around and see what we can find. Then I'm kind of thinking maybe we just do the V8 upgrade. We'll see, because I also, I think I might have enough money just to try those gears. So we might go to town and just try that. Because maybe that'll give us the power we need, you know? I also want to check out what that, like, blue thing over there. Kind of hard to see, but there's, like, I don't know, looks like a little tent or house or something over there. So maybe we'll go to there after the shop. Okay, let's check how much, oh my god, actually they're a little pricier than I thought they were. But from what I can tell, I guess these are even a little bit better, no? Because they're 4.1, and I think the manual says ours are just 4.0. I'm assuming these are the way to go. 5.0. Okay, so I'll still need a little bit more money. Okay, so I was looking at our missions, and apparently the guy over there got his, like, tires taken or something like that. So the game wants me to find four tires for him. And it says I could get him at the junkyard. So let's go check that out. Also went ahead and just bought a bunch of stuff at the little store. Kind of just got one of everything because I don't know maybe we could get into like the moon shining or something else. I'm not sure if that's something that'll come from like a mission or we just gotta kind of figure it out ourselves. All right let me sell that fridge I found. Okay. And then we'll kind of take a look around here. It says four tires. It's technically in the junkyard so I mean it should be his but I guess they'll still give go. us money for it. All right. Let's see if we can find those tires. I mean, if it comes down to it, we do have four back at the house. So I could technically just give them mine. Yeah, I'm not seeing any tires, though. Okay, well, I think I should go talk to him first. Just to kind of accept the mission. And then from there, maybe he'll give me more info. I don't want it to be like the radio tower where, like, I didn't accept and had to do it twice. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to him. Some asshole stole my wheels off my car last night. So I ain't getting anywhere until I get some new wheels. You think you find some cheap ones for me at the junkyard? I need, uh, let's see, four of them. So I guess we'll just go back to the junkyard. Because, I don't know, maybe now they're spawned in, you know? Oh, yeah, okay, here's one. 
Okay, 15 bucks, not bad. I don't know if that was already there and I just missed it or if it actually just spawned in. Oh, okay. Number two is right here. Kind of worried that like one of them might spawn kind of underground and I don't see it. Oh, and number three is right there. Okay. Okay, so just one more. I like how I chose to do this at night when it's like the least visibility. And it's raining too, so. Hmm. Oh, okay, nice. Found the fourth one. Pretty much took all night. I think it's about to be morning. So that was four tires at $15 each. So $60. Oh. Open a bag of crap. It kind of just exploded here. So hopefully we get like a hundred bucks or something. Okay. And here we are. So let's go ahead and drop off those tires. There's one, two, three, and four. All right. Let's see how much that got us. I mean, what was that, like 180 bucks or something? Okay, that was pretty good. Okay, let me go sell this junk, and then I think we'll have more than enough to buy those drive gears. Alright, and yeah, since we have the money, we'll just go straight for the upgraded ones. It's gonna be bad for our gas, but, I don't know, more interested about having the extra power. And here's the second one. And nice, we still have 600 bucks. Let me check about that fan clutch again, or whatever. Because it still does make that, like, whirring sound. So, I mean, I'll buy it. I'm pretty sure I already switched it out earlier. But I don't know. Maybe I damaged it and it got worn out. Oh, what the heck? I didn't know you could save your game here. Oh, it cost $50, though. Okay. I didn't know that was a thing. That's kind of cool. Alright, let's head back and switch those out. And plus, it gives me a chance to drop off all this stuff. Alright, and here we are. Also, I think my view got messed up because now I can't even really... I can't see the gas. So... I don't know, something, something's weird there. Not sure why. Oh, if you click Q, you could like peek out the window. Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, let me unload all this stuff. Okay, somehow the view resetted, so that's good. Alright, so this should be simple enough. Just four bolts and we're pretty much done. Wait, no, I think there's some stuff inside. There's four more bolts in here. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, and these were the exact same ones at the store. So I would have wasted like 300 bucks buying those for nothing. Alright, this should just pop in and... 8 bolts to go. Alright, that's the back one done. Now for the front one. Just the cover now. And cool, upgrade complete. Yeah, let's see about that fan clutch. Because again, maybe that's making all that noise. Take the fan out. And then I think the belt should pop out right here. Okay. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What am I doing? What the heck's going on? Oh, no, 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 no. I am literally stuck. Oh, okay. Uh, that's not good. Can I, like, wedge it out? Nope, oh, I think I'm going to make it worse. Okay. Um. Okay, let me see if I could reverse it out a little. Oh no, the check engine light's on now. Okay, I for sure like- I mean, oh yeah, the fan's off, duh. Duh, what am I thinking? Of course the check engine light's gonna be on. Oh, we did make a big dent though. Okay, that's bad. Alright, let's go ahead and change the clutch. Oh, it just literally pops out. But again, yeah, that didn't- it didn't look bad. Alright, where's the new one? I had it somewhere. I literally just had it. Where'd I put it? Uh oh. I remember seeing it like somewhere around here. I don't know. Maybe it got launched when the truck went into the wall. Okay, yeah. I completely lost it. So we're just going to have to put on the old one and buy another one. I'm just kind of worried something got damaged when it got stuck in the wall. But hopefully that check engine light was just because the fan wasn't on, you know? And I think I could fix that like dent with the welder. Oh, okay, it was doing something. See, I think my game's bugged because it only lets me use it on that one door. But then it's not fixing this. Like, at all. Clicking E, I'm left clicking, I'm right clicking. And nothing happens other than when I click on this door. So, I don't know. Maybe my game's a little bugged there. Okay, let's see if the check engine stays on. 
Okay, it turned off. Sweet. Yeah, obviously it still makes that noise, but everything else seems to be fine. So it should use more gas, but it should also have more power now. Let me just get to like that flat road by the town and we can see. Okay, so we should be able to go full throttle here. And yeah, uh, I don't know. Kind of feels the same, if I'm being honest. I mean, you kind of saw we topped out like 30. And I don't think that was much higher than before. Maybe it's better going up hills? Let's see. I mean, I don't know. Kind of still feels the same, to be honest. Okay, let's go ahead and try another mission. Yeah, because there's this about like a pallet of steel beams to the tower. So I think we got to talk to the radio tower guy and then he'll send us to one of those. Oh my god, imagine having to go up that. I think we will. That's a brutal incline, okay. Hopefully it's not that one. Okay, so I'm guessing this is the pallet right there. Got this pallet of steel beams I need hauled up to one of my towers. Oh, it's like the really far tower. Okay, I haven't been over there yet. Oh, this is really hard to see. Okay, well, let's go ahead and try. Okay, so it seems like somewhere in this community there's going to be a little exit. Like a middle road over here. It seems like there's two roads I can take. Let me try this left one, because that right one had like some brutal uphill right away. So maybe this one's just a little longer but flatter. Okay, so this might be hard getting back. Uh oh! I was going to say going down wasn't too bad, but never mind. Alright, we should be getting close to the turn, which I think is right here. Yeah. Oh no, don't flip over. Okay. Maybe I should have really bought that, like, wench. Yeah, we still don't have enough power. Come on. I'm, like, almost there. Okay. So I think I just, again, need to get a little bit more speed like last time. Alright, let's go, 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 go. Come on. Okay, I made it over that little bump. I say little bump. But, you know, it's actually like a pretty big hill. It just doesn't look it when you're inside the truck. Okay, I gotta plow through this. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, we're really struggling now. Come on. We're almost there, come on. I'm dropping the clutch. It's giving us a little boost of power. But I think those drives actually did make a difference. It's like, I'm like 90% sure we would not have made that without that. Okay, sweet. And I guess I just put him right here. But hey, this actually gives us a pretty good view of the map. Like, I think that's like the city area over there. Or maybe the community. It's kind of hard to tell. And that might be our house way over there. It really puts it into perspective how high this like hill is. Or mountain, really. Okay. Well, it's here. Let's go ahead and head back and get our money. I think this guy does pay pretty well. I forget, I think for the water tower it was like 300 bucks or something, so... Pretty dang good. You know, I kind of wonder, is there any reason to turn the four-wheel drive off? Because I've kind of just kept it on this whole time, you know? But I don't know, maybe for the race, like when you're on the street, it's better just to have two-wheel drive. And then, like right now, when I'm going uphill or something or off-road, it's better to have the four-wheel for traction. Maybe we'll test that theory out and see which one gives more speed. Okay, this is the hill I was kind of worried about, so... Oh, what did I hit? Oh, come on, that's, that was not fair. There was literally nothing there. Okay, but I mean, yeah, yeah, I still made it. Okay, let's talk to him. Thank you. Nice. Here you go. Okay, we're at 584. Okay, yeah, 300 bucks. That's actually, that's not too bad. Alright, my guy's getting a little tired. So let's head back and have him sleep. Alright, so I just filled the truck with gas, but I kind of want to take a different way home. Just kind of want to see what that little, like, blue cabin looking thing is. I think if I take this road, it should lead us towards the lake. Because I think, like, right towards that middle of it is where it's at. I think there's a little dirt road here, yeah. Okay, this is actually pretty nice. What's that? Oh, what the heck? What is this? Okay, let's, let's get out and look. 
Okay, so I'm guessing that the water guy is going to give me a mission about this. Where I maybe have to fill that up and take it somewhere. Okay, let's check what's over here. Oh, my guy's going really, really slow. It did not like me in the water. Okay, let's get out. Okay. I also wonder what's on this little island over there. It's just kind of in the middle. And I don't know if there's really a way to get there. Unless it's trying to say, like, that path with the trees is a way to get there. So it might be worth looking into. But yeah, for right now, I think I'll just leave this here until the guy gives me the mission or something. Yeah, let's go ahead and head back home to sleep and see if there's more missions. You know, this gives me a good chance to uh, spin out, but actually, I want to try turning off the four-wheel drive and see if we go faster on, like, the straight road over here. Let's see. Nah, still seems like we top out at 30 miles per hour. Alright, let's go ahead and sleep and we'll check the missions in the morning. Oh, okay, so we got another mission from that. I think his name's Jake, is that right? Yeah, Jake, okay. So I guess he found out who took his wheels, and he wants some revenge. It does say to bring the mechanic creeper, so I think he's talking about this thing. Oh, I have to be really careful in here. I do not want to damage the truck anymore. So yeah, I think we just have to bring this. So I'm guessing we might go to, like, a car and, like, steal some parts or something. Alright, let's go ahead and see what he wants. I figured out who stole my wheels. They actually live a couple streets over. I want you to get underneath the car, loosen the oil drain bolt, while this pay if you add some sugar to the gas tank. And do it at night. And one thing, don't forget to bring the creeper. Okay. So I guess I gotta go to that house, what do you say? Take out the oil, and then put sugar in their gas tank. What the heck, well, how is this here? That was not there last time. I swear. Okay, so I think what happened with the clutch, it was just like under something, and I guess me driving just like lodged it out. Okay, but he does want us to do it at night, so we do have some time. So I think what I'll do, drop off my little mechanic creeper over here, just kind of have stuff ready, and then I'll go to the store, get the sugar, and then I think I'll just start selling all this junk around here, because I saw lots of like fridges and stuff like that, so yeah, let's make some money in the meantime. And I'll meet back over here at night. Oh no 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 no. Oh my god, it's- Oh my god. No. Okay, so we might have a situation here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Not exactly what I wanted to happen, but that was pretty close. Okay. I mean, it worked out, so yeah. Oh, the door, I did. I didn't see that. Hey, but I think that's the one door I could actually fix. Alright, so it's officially nighttime. I pretty much spent the whole day just like selling junk and even trash at some points. And I'm just about $2,000, so not bad. I went ahead and changed the clutch thing, and it didn't change anything. And I'm still seeing a lot of smoke, so I don't know. Maybe it's a head gasket thing. Alright, let's go ahead and do this job. So, I think he wanted us to go under the car and take out the transmission bolt. Or the, no, the engine. Engine oil, yeah. So, I should just be able to loosen this. And it should come draining out. Right? And then I think he wants me to put sugar in the tank. Oh, there we go. Okay. So I think that's a job complete. I swear, he better be paying me pretty well for this because I'm literally committing a crime for him. All right, it does look like it's completed because the, the mark is over there. So let's go see. All right, let's see what's up. You actually did it. <laughs> I'm going to pay you good for this one. I mean, he did say he's paying me good, so let's see. Okay, yeah, I mean, that was like, what, 250 almost, maybe? Maybe 300-ish? Okay, that, that was well worth it. All right. Does he have something else to say? Or is that just... Just oh. Job. He's been looking for an alcohol supplier. So here's what I'm thinking. Ask Jigs Casey to show you how to make some moonshine. Then make some and well, I'll see if we can sell it. Okay, cool, cool. So now I unlocked like that moonshine mission stuff. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm assuming if you go talk to that guy, he'll give us the recipe, and then we can start making that. And man, yeah, we're almost there to get the V8 engine. We just need like, I think it was like a thousand two hundred more. I forget what the number was. Yeah, I earned a lot of money today in the game, so. I think we'll leave it there. We'll just try to get the rest of like the 1,000 we need and start buying the V8 stuff. So yeah, see ya. Thanks for watching. Bye.